In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for Li plus H2O. So the first thing we need to do is balance the molecular equation. This is our molecular equation. I can see I have one hydrogen here and two here. So I have three hydrogens on the product side and two here. I'll get this to an even number. So now I have two times the one plus these two. So I have four hydrogens, two times one, two oxygens, two lithiums. If I put a two as my coefficient, now I have four hydrogens, two oxygens. So those are balanced, two lithiums, put a two here. That's the balanced molecular equation. Now I need to write the states for each substance. Lithium, that's a metal, that's a solid. Water is a liquid. And then we're gonna assume we have an excess of water. We just put lithium in a bunch of water, it reacted. Our lithium hydroxide, this is gonna be soluble. It's gonna dissolve in water. If you know your solubility rules or you could look it up on a solubility chart, it'll be aqueous. So it's gonna dissolve, split apart into its ions. Hydrogen, H2, that's a gas. So we have our states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into ions. The only thing that's an electrolyte is LiOH. It's the only thing that's aqueous. Lithium is one plus. If you look at the periodic table, it's in group one. And then the hydroxide, that's always one minus. So we can split this up when we write out the equation, which will be two Li solid plus two H2O, which will be a liquid and that'll yield two Li plus ions, and those will be aqueous, plus the two hydroxide ions, which will also be aqueous, plus hydrogen gas. And this is both the complete ionic equation and it's the net ionic equation, because there's no spectator ions that we can cross out. Nothing is the same on either side. We have lithium solid here, but here it's an ion. We can't cross that out. Here we have two water molecules as a liquid, but now we have this OH minus, which is aqueous, the hydroxide ion, and then hydrogen gas. So that's it, the net ionic equation for Li plus H2O. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.